Hello, everyone, and welcome into more Ticket to Ride here on the Sorcerer Network. Let's do this thing. Um, all right, we got a really nice um, east-west group of tickets here. Um, we're definitely not going Calgary to Phoenix, but I think we can go Kansas City to Boston, Boston to Washington, Dallas to New York, Los Angeles to Chicago, and uh, feel pretty good about that. That really sets us up very nicely, to be honest with you. So uh, Los Angeles to Phoenix is going to be the uh, priority. Um, the good news is I have two blues already. Um, and so hopefully I can get either a wild or a blue, but that's going to be great. And then the rest of this stuff we can kind of... The, the nice thing about all this is we got we got lots of ways that we can connect it. And then we're connecting up Boston, New York, Washington, Chicago... And we've got this middle of the map, too. Even down to Houston, as well, is not impossible. All right, so far, everyone's kept four with only one opponent to, to go. Um, I get to go first? Oh, my goodness. Oh, happy day. All right, um, I want probably black. I guess probably green or white would have been acceptable, but... So what I'm looking at right now is going Los Angeles, Phoenix, El Paso to Dallas, up to Kansas City, over to Chicago, and then kind of, you know, branching up into here. Um, this is probably the direction that we could go. I mean, we could easily go through Little Rock. We could, you know, there's a lot of things we can do. But right now, next turn, we're going Los Angeles to Phoenix, which we probably should get outside of some pretty unlucky. Like, the fact that you start with four cards... Um, the fact that it, it would be very unlucky if someone had three of them right off the bat. So that is excellent. Um, an excellent, excellent start. So now we're looking for um, red, yellow, black, orange, green, white. Um, that's kind of the main stuff that we're looking for here. So, like, yeah, don't mind that, and don't mind that. Because uh, Washington to New York and New York to Boston are going to be two things that we're going to want to get. Um, but I also don't feel like, again, I need to, like, rush it. I just need to get good stuff. Because um, <clears throat> if I can have either side, then I can react to whatever my opponents do. And I would, I guess, on one hand, I would like to get the yellow side here um, because um, uh, I, I want to use red for El Paso to Dallas. Um, so maybe it's worth... Okay, that's actually kind of nice. Because now we're looking at, we have, we almost have, we can get the white here. We have all the cards to get this little pod of routes here. And I kind of like that. Huh. Okay, the white doesn't is not there. I still might kind of go for it. Like, okay, well, now there's another white. Okay, yeah, I'm going to grab that. And then, um, yeah, I'll need the red long term, so might as well grab it. All right, I think I'm going to try to go for this pod here now. Um... Prioritizing Boston to New York. That's fine. That actually is really great because now that informs us that Vegas is closed. Blue and yellow still have not played, which is good and bad. It's good because the board is open. It's bad that we really don't know where where they're wanting to be. <clears throat> I'm thinking that me playing up here may trigger some of this. <laughs> Let's see if yellow reacts to that. Blue did not. Hmm, okay. Uh, I'm going to prioritize here because uh, um, connecting these two up is, I think, uh, more vital. 
because we could very easily go, if we don't get this, we could easily go zoop and then over through Chicago. Either one is fine. I just like connecting up Pittsburgh because Pittsburgh does have some more, some other stuff. Let's see what yellow does off of that because clearly they needed to get up into Montreal, which means they probably need to go down into this way. Yep. Okay, so that's where, um, like, yeah, we'll just do this. And then um, I'll use my two white to grab uh, Pittsburgh to Washington. I suppose I could get greedy, um, which I think I'm gonna. And get a pair, like grab this orange for Pittsburgh to Washington, and then uh, use the two white to go Chicago to St. Louis. Okay, well, I'm going to go this Oh, Didn't mean to hit that top button, but I guess I will take the one pink that I got. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to use my red here. So how, how long do I continue to roll this dice here? <clears throat> with that i think i continue to roll it a little bit longer um i mean just take one off the top there's not really anything that i desperately need All right, depending on what yellow does, I may grab Chicago to St. Louis here because I think that's where they're going down this way. Yeah, we're gonna go, we're gonna do this. And then, unless there's a red on board, I'm going to go Washington to Pittsburgh. Okay. Answers that question. All right. So that connects up this little place here. We got one pink going in here. We, we, we might be in a position to draw some more tickets here as well which would be insane before Blue's even played, which leads me to wonder what in the world does Blue have? Because this is very late to have played nothing. Continues to draw. Unless, and so, so the, the reason I want to draw maybe a little bit early is what I hope Blue is not doing is a strat excuse me, a strategy of like, can I gain a bunch of stuff and then go out? So I'm gonna grab this. I'm gonna grab off the top. Um I think I grabbed Phoenix to El Paso here with the three pink. Again, unless there's a red on board. It's, it's really this pod of stuff I'm not concerned about. This stuff I'm slightly concerned about, like I want to nail it down. So, um, so yeah, I'm going to grab three pink there. That feels good. Yeah, I'd like to see a little bit more red. I suppose, yeah, and there's really not a way. Red is going to be the easiest route just based on what cards I have. Um, yeah. All right, there's nothing great on board here. Let's just draw some early tickets here. Um, so um, I think we grab three here. Montreal to Raleigh, St. Louis to Miami, Toronto to Charleston. 
I think we can do all those. Um, up to Toronto is the most risky. Otherwise, we can continue to work down this way. All right, that's that's interesting. It's interesting that that was your first route. All right, so orange, yes. Pink, yes. And then we're going to prioritize Pittsburgh to Toronto with my pair of oranges. Okay, so blue plays there. Green goes up there. All right, all right. Montreal, a very popular place to get into. So yeah, let's let's grab this. Cause uh now down here doesn't feel as it feels like a lot of people have all these north northeast stuff. Down here doesn't feel as um of an of an of an importance here. The good news about this is we really just outside of the four pink and the four red, we just need pairs. That's it. Um I do have to remember to connect up Montreal to Boston as well. Um so but I, I I think I think this we're in we're in really nice shape here. I don't I don't think that we're super concerned about what's going on. Still, really, the only thing that I'm worried about is blue just like laying everything down because the one thing about this is we are gonna need quite a lot of turns here. Especially because we have nowhere near the amount of cards necessary to complete this. And maybe that should have made us more cautious. But I, I don't know. I stand by I stand by the decision here. Alright, so yeah, blue's going this way. Seems like blue's going for like a Sault Ste. Marie to San Francisco route. Alright, so pink, yes. And then there's a pair. So unless there's a pink and red staying on here would be ideal. Um... Okay, so red and pink. So unless there's a pink on board, I'm going to grab El Paso to Dallas. And that gets one of my big routes done. Yeah, this concerns me slightly with what blue is doing. Turns me slightly with what yellow's doing. All right, we can do that. Um, okay. So now it's just it's just like we need a pink, and then we need pairs of stuff. We just need as many pairs. We need one, two, three, four wild pairs, and then a pair of probably blue, because we're going to use our pink here. So unless there's a pink or a blue, we're just grabbing whatever pair is on board. Oh, I guess I need Montreal to Boston as well. So I need one, two, three, four, five. Um, yes. So there's a pair. Love that. Um... And I think I want to prioritize, it really doesn't matter. It doesn't look like much is being contested here. Okay, blue playing some of these smaller routes is helping me feel a little bit better. Um, same with like yellow grabbing this one route. Like, yes, grab, grab a 
Grab a route of one or two. That's going to be excellent for us. I'm also hoping that I've spooked them with my seven. And I can kind of... Yeah, so now we grab this pair. Lovely. If we're getting a pair per turn, that is good. And I may do some playing intermittently. If there's not a pair, a pink or a blue on board. If I didn't have to connect up Kansas City, I would just go down Little Rock, Dallas. But I have to connect up Kansas City. Yeah, I don't love that the pink was there. Oh, holy wilds, Batman. All right. That spooks me enough to do this. Cuz I uh, can't can't lose out on that. <laughs> um all right, so blue goes there. Okay, that's good. I want to reset there. All right, can I get that pink? Ooh, those two blue are tempting, but I'm gonna go with the, gonna go with the pink. And now I think we complete this Miami down to Miami uh, uh, section here. Um, let's let's make a push to do that. Um, if if there's a blue, I guess I will grab it. But then that that kind of solidifies. Um, that kind of solidifies everything here. All right, even if there's a blue on board, I just kind of thought, of, I've got to grab Miami to Charleston because if if there's a world where we lose out on that, now we're we're very much toast. Yeah, so we got to do this. Because um, if we miss out on that, like if yellow wants to get down in there and we miss out on it, we can't grab five blue and six red and get over and like there's there's it's just not gonna happen. Great, this is all fantastic. Um, so now we grab our blue, and then we can just grab one off the top. Hoping for a wild there. All right, let us now uh, prioritize Kansas City to St. Louis, getting the blue side. And then we can kind of finish up, I think, this East Coast section before we try to um, grab what's going on down here. Um, I think we are okay. I'm a little bit nervous about green and blue, and yellow for that matter, just kind of you know, ending this thing, but, um, I, I think, I think we have stabilized enough that we have enough time, assuming we can hit pairs off the board. Um, I, I think we have enough time here to complete these tickets. Um, Okay, great. Love love the destination tickets. Love, love that. Yeah, I think I'm going to go pairs here. Because each of these, I have pairs. And I just now, everything I need is wild. And so I have pairs. And I just need four more of them. Which, I mean, I have two of them. So I only need two more of them. So if I have a pair on board for the taking, I'm going to take it. keeps two yeah so we're keeping we're taking that 
And then, like, if that pink can stay, that would be excellent because then we have everything we need and hopefully we can, um, you know, we, we have enough turns then in order to make that happen, which I think we do. Hmm. Don't love that that pink got taken. However, the fact that we have a pair on board is excellent. Okay, there we go. So um, priorities are Raleigh to Washington, Montreal to Boston, and then Kansas City, Oklahoma City, Oklahoma City to Dallas. That is the priority. All right, that makes me really nervous. <laughs> that, that, I no, don't love that. Um, yeah, that, that, this is, made, this is, this is not great. Um, so, um, however, with, with what they have on board, green cannot end the game. And I love that they choose destination tickets because now I want to prioritize Dallas to Kansas city. And then, um, cause if I don't hit Montreal to Raleigh or Raleigh, I don't know why I uh, emphasized lead that weirdly. Anyway, um, Raleigh, that's not as big of a loss. If I miss out on Los Angeles to Chicago and Dallas to New York, I, I'm, I'm definitely not winning this game. Um, I'm still not convinced that I'm going to, I'm still not convinced that I'm going to do very well in this game regardless, but, uh, um, you know, we, we definitely got to go from there, but here's the thing. Green cannot end this, this turn. They have to draw. Um, and then, and then play. So I will will at least get two more turns. So there's that. So now that gets Los Angeles, Chicago, Dallas, New York, and then next turn we can go Montreal to Raleigh. Um, do I think that my tickets are going to be enough to win this game? Is now the question that I have to ask myself. Hmm. I don't know is the is the real answer to that question. Um Cuz like who who am I concerned about? Green because they just have so much they're so far ahead of me. And probably have like Vancouver to Montreal. Maybe a. Hmm. I don't think that I feel confident enough to walk in with just this. So, um. That is excellent. And I, I know I'm two away from Chicago to Santa Fe. I know I'm, you know, close to this. I, I, let's just keep the one 20-pointer and, and not, not have to worry about because green is in a position that they could end it, and I really don't want to lose, purposely lose anything um, if I don't have to. Yeah, yeah, perfect. Perfect, perfect read on this. Ugh, ugh. It feels so good. Yeah, that that 20 pointer might have just won us the game. Might have just won us the game. Alright, we'll just go down to Houston because we have the one card. We'll see. I mean, Green does have a 30 point lead on board. Um, which is not nothing. I'm not worried about blue. That's the person I'm not worried about. <laughs> I shouldn't say that. Um, you know, they have just connect everything up. All right, so we get we we get the fifteen point bonus. Um, that's that's happening, um, and we have two pretty big tickets with a couple of medium tickets with some smaller tickets. So we'll kind of see where we're at. That twenty point ticket made me feel a lot more 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 uh, settled about that. Okay, so blue definitely not worried about because they missed one and uh, only have four tickets and really didn't have a lot. All right, green had Winnipeg to Seve. There's the Vancouver to Montreal. So the big question is, can I stay within striking distance of, of green? 
Um, all right, so I'm I'm within striking distance there. All right, yellow just just whoa, what happened, yellow? Um, so the question is, does green have longest train? And I think the answer is yes. Yeah. Oh, most definitely. Woo! Good game. Good game by um. Yeah, say I it, the fact that I hit that twenty point ticket was uh, <laughs> was uh, was a miracle there. Um, great game by by Green there. Um, uh, but I, I think a really solid game on our part as well. I mean, the fact that we kind of rolled the dice, got that twenty point route plus that fifteen, um, uh, uh, really you know vaulted us into. I mean, we would have been fine without the twenty point ticket in second place. But uh, the fact that we were that close to green um, is really it was really really good. Uh, great game by green. Um, would have been really nice had we had we had one extra turn, we would have gotten El Paso to Santa Fe, and that would have gotten us Chicago to Santa Fe, and that would have vaulted us over. But we would have missed it. So um, uh, if we if we could have known we would have had one more turn, that would have been great. Um, so great game. Yeah, wonderful. Ah, oh, man, I love these teams. Tickets ride. All right. Hey, if you're enjoying the content, hit that subscribe button, uh, like, and comment, and we will see you next time.